Hi, I'm testing out my solitaire playing program to see if there's any issues with it. Let's start with a game of Pyramid. So you can see I'm running Windows 10 with Microsoft Solitaire Collection. I've got the regular theme, the classic theme, the regular deck of cards, and I've got this toolbar at the bottom toggled on so that the program can interact with it. Let's try running this thing. The first thing it tries to do is undo all just in case you're in the middle of a game. Now it's flipping through the cards that are face down. Once it does that, now it, it'll know all 52 cards and be able to find out the solution. Another thing is that the program starts printing out the window size, expected window size, and so on, just in case there's an issue. Once it finds a solution, it prints it out on the command prompt and then undoes the board and starts playing. Great, now it's finished. There's something else we can try in case you have an issue. This might be able to help. Now instead of running Solitaire Player Pyramid, I'm going to add a special prompt. Show prompts. And so once it flips through the deck, this time it'll actually display what it thinks the cards are. So there's a little extra step in between reading the cards and then starting to play. So it might take a little bit of time, but here's what the cards are. This is the prompt that lets you correct any mistakes that it's made in recognizing the cards. If you click OK, now it'll try to find the solution. This could take any number of seconds, up to a minute. Usually it's pretty fast, though. And now it'll say press yes to play the solution, no to quit.
While we're at it, let's try Tripeaks. This one's a little different because there's a lot of face down cards that you have to play the game to figure out what they are to uncover them. And so it'll try to do that on its own. It's not optimally playing the game, but it's trying its best to figure out what the cards are. And once it knows enough, then it'll reset the, undo the whole game and then start from the beginning. It could undo the board multiple times until it figures out what all the cards are. That's it.